Hi, I'm David Hill with New York Habitat. Welcome to our video tour of Kensington. Not only a great place to stay in the heart of the city, but also home to some of the city's best shopping. London is divided into local authority districts known as boroughs. The Royal Borough of Kensington and Chelsea is the most densely populated in the UK and one of the wealthiest. Kensington and Chelsea runs from the River Thames in the south to Harrow Road in the north. It's approximately four miles long and two miles wide. This is the most popular destination for visitors looking for short-term accommodation in London. If you're coming to London for the shopping, then Kensington and Chelsea is the place to be. Here on the Kensington High Street, you can enjoy some retail therapy at well-known UK shopping outlets. Why not take a stroll down King's Road in the heart of Chelsea, a highly fashionable area for Londoners to shop and be seen. At the top end of King's Road is Sloane Square. From Sloane Square, you can walk up Sloane Street, passing some of the world's most famous retail outlets. Gucci, Chanel, Jimmy Choo, Prada and more. Sloane Street hits Knightsbridge just below London's Hyde Park, and just around the corner, you'll find probably London's most renowned department store, Harrods. This wonderful building is the Natural History Museum, home to some 70 million specimens. The Science Museum and the Victoria and Albert Museum are only yards away. Between the Albert Memorial in Hyde Park and the Natural History Museum is the Royal Albert Hall. This building is renowned as home to the summer proms every year since 1941. South Kensington is a thriving hub of art and culture. New York Habitat has a wide range of apartments throughout Kensington and Chelsea. From small studios to luxury townhouses, there are plenty of options to choose from. Take a look through our inventory. Kensington and Chelsea may be one of the UK's wealthiest areas, but there are some real gems here that won't break the bank. Immortalized by the Hollywood movie starring Julia Roberts, Notting Hill has a unique charm. Renowned for its artistic culture, it attracted a migrant Caribbean and Mediterranean population before becoming highly desirable in the 1990s. If you're looking for trendy, little-known designers, secondhand clothes, or antiques, then Portobello Market is the place to come to. Diverse and colorful, just like the architecture, there is something for everyone. Make sure you head down to Portobello on a Saturday for the open markets. If you're in need of a quiet stroll or a place to relax, then you should head to Kensington Gardens. This 110 hectare park is actually half of what most people know as Hyde Park. It's open from 6 a.m. to dusk every day. Why not take a look at the Italian Gardens or visit the Albert Memorial? Kensington does not have the same urgency as Soho or the professionalism of the city. What Kensington does have is charm, elegance, and a wonderful selection of bars and restaurants. So if you decide to rent an apartment in Kensington and Chelsea, you won't have to go far to be entertained.
Well, we've come to the end of our video tour of Kensington and Chelsea. If you know of any fun places in the area that you'd like to share with us, please make sure to leave a comment in the comment section below. And if you're coming to London, be sure to visit our website at nyhabitat.com and book a vacation rental or furnished apartment with New York Habitat. You'll find furnished apartments all over London. I'm David Hill with New York Habitat. Thank you for watching our video tour of Kensington and Chelsea. We hope to see you soon in the great city of London.